Okay, we went that way, and all there was was an NPC village. And if I remember right, if we go that way, this is a jungle biome. All I need is one ash tree. Just one. Because I can get seedlings from the... from the leaves and branches of it. Okay, pumpkins. Haven't touched on those yet. Now, here is the hazards of block lag and everything else lag in Minecraft. You can see all down underneath the earth there and all the caverns and what's down there below and the tunnels down to them and everything else until all the blocks catch up and everything refreshes and then you're just looking at the normal ground again. Uh, there's not much promise for other land out there, so this could take a while. Over here we see sugar cane. Only need a couple pieces of that. And I can make my own sugar cane farm. way you mine that is just smacking it. Now, this poses, uh, presents me with a different problem. Okay, here's a place I can stop and actually dig in. Not much chance of much of anything coming out from here. First thing I want to do is put a block down to mark which direction to travel. Now as you see, you can't remove much here that you won't let water in. So I'll make me a step. Okay. Now, something that I've learned, she can put a torch down. put a pumpkin over it and if you look at that one it actually turns into a jack-o-lantern and now you've got something that will actually glow
Yeah, nothing much around here, so I'll set it up now. And since I'm being daring, I'll show you what the fishing thing's all about. See? Now it glows. And you can see it from quite a ways off. Now the fishing pole, basically you just cast it out there and watch the bobber. When the bobber goes down, you hit the right mouse button and reel in your fish. Since I don't have a bed to sleep, I might as well be productive while I'm out here on this lonely little stretch. And there's me a fish. And just like with real fishing, occasionally you miss one. But if you want to eat, you don't want to have to plant and sow wheat. You, this is a good way to be able to eat pretty easily. It does involve some time though. Not much skill, but a lot of time. Okay, now this isn't anywhere that, this is back in the general direction of what I came from. But, and here's another NPC village. But this is not the one that we were at before. Okay, so apples and six more loaves of bread and an iron ingot. See, sometimes you can actually come across some interesting things in these villages.